look at that. That's it. Oh, another one. There's another torp in the water. Woohoo! Two close calls. This is dangerous, this one. Whoa! Three torps. Welcome back everyone. It is good to be back. It's fantastic to be here to bring you another episode of our campaign playthrough on Ultimate Admiral's Dreadnoughts. Thanks for joining me and please smash that like and subscribe button if you haven't already. And thanks to everybody who has so far and who is enjoying the series. So let's get straight into it. So last time on our episode we were in two major battles or one minor one major. Uh, the first battle we pretty much got annihilated, so we came out there pretty badly. And the second battle will equal, and we both uh, got away with minor damage. But the biggest thing from our last episode was we were able to put our first own built ship, the first, the Wombat number one battleship, or the first series Wombat class battleship, which was, oh, I can actually show you right now. Let's have a quick look at what this uh, battleship was like. So the only real difference of what the stock was here is that we had researched a bit more armor or a, bit he a little bit heavier armor. So we have a few bit, little bit more heavy, heavier armor, but we have put on some higher uh, or bigger guns. So we'll see how that pans out once that's built, but that's a little bit away yet. So let's get straight into uh, throwing in another turn. And we have an ambush. Whoa, so this one's a hard one. So we're actually torpedo boats against a battleship. So I'm gonna run from this one. I can withdraw. I'm definitely not taking on these fast torpedo boats. So we're gonna withdraw from that battle. Oh, so we're far now we've got no choice. All right, so I think we'll uh, jump into this battle and see how we work it out. Uh, let's find out where they are and let's go the opposite way, I would say. They probably will catch us though. So they're in the southwest. So they're actually directly that way. So let's move away. Because as you can see, we are quite slow. So let's speed ahead and see if we can get out and maneuver them. But otherwise, it's going to be a fleeing fight. They have spotted us. There they are. But we are going totally the opposite way because we do not have a chance in fighting this. All right. Once we identify, we'll see if we can get, we've got all our guns while we're on that guy. So that's gonna be, let's see what we are, 96. We should be able to identify him right now. There you go, two torps each. Gonna be interesting, what do we got? We have 11 inch. Oh, so it's quite similar to what we built with our Wombat class. Um, but they've got a couple of smaller six inches, but um, I'm not fighting, I'm running. It's the smartest move to do. Unless I can get some some damage on them. See if I can bring while we run all our guns to bear. So we really need to damage them quite early. Now if we throw in some armor piercing, we might be able to slow them down. But as long as we slow them down, so we can fill them with some water, maybe damage their engines, we might have some luck, but I don't think we're gonna outrun them. Because we're a lot slower. They've probably got 21. Twenty-two. So they're quite fast. Do I get rid of that? Oh, 
There we go. One down. And we might be able to now swing you around so we can get that second guns to bear on that other one. So we've slowed one down. Let's go to the next. Does mean we're going to reset. But all we need to do... What's his... We've got plenty of range. He'll pump that out and be back for another fight. Come on. There we go. Next one out. He'll bugger off now, I think. Let's have a look. Yep, he's off. Can we get another? So we've got some. Go the next. We're at five percent on the big guns. They're still quite a bit away from torpedo range. So if we can keep doing some of this minor damage, we might have some luck. Stay in the distance. Sending them to the back of the line. We're at 8% now. As you can see, 8%. Already caused two floodings and two fires. Lock down to two times and open up. Here we go. Ooh, must be getting close. We are 12%. Come on. We're doing some minor damage, but nothing. I need to get below the waterline. Oh, there we go. Minor, minor flooding. We might bug out. But what's our distance for torpedo range? All right, we're getting quite close. All right, all right. Um, let's try to get one more salvo up and then we'll turn to... Seventeen percent, so we should be able to damage him on this salvo. Alright, what are we close? Yep, let's bug out. There we go. Another flood that might send him off. We got a fire on board. It's only minor. Still might be able to take him out. We're still at 18% chance. And he is bugging out. But let's go straight. Hopefully, as he passes, we'll get a shot. Too far for those torps. He does want to launch though. Nice one. Lots of fires. He's slowed down a lot. Actually, the one behind him. 
that we might need to start concentrating on. So let's turn around. And I think we'll get ready to open up on this. Because we've damaged the rest of them. We'll let this salvo fly and then we'll go try to slow this one down. There we go. Nice shot. Wait, 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 wait. We don't want to go there. This is dangerous. Hope you land your shots. Let's get out of here. This is super dangerous. Oh dear. He's trying to get the top range too, but he's damaged. He's bugging out. We might be lucky. Nah, he's going into top range. We might be able to turn around. He's going to launch. I'm sure he's going to launch. No, we're just on the edge. He didn't launch. RIT. We got another one. Let's do that one. That damaged? Yeah. Okay. Alright, as long as he doesn't hit our engines, we're okay. If they hit our engines, we're in deep. Getting too close. Took out one of his guns, or did they take one of our guns? Oh no, they took out a couple of our small guns. Alright, now we're in top range. Ah. We're gonna be hit. Will we? Whoa, look at that. Look at that. That's it. He's going to take a while to reload. Whoa. Did you see that? How lucky are we? Time to finish him off. wait until that's three quarters around then we'll start bugging out before the torpedo's loaded he's bugging out I think I think it's time we put some heat on him I think we'll do heat there we go He's bugging out.
There we go. Whew. He's in severe problems. But he'll stay afloat to fight another day. I'm staying in this battle. I want it. Let's go after this guy very fast. Trying to turn. Fifteen percent, and he's pumping the water out. And they hit each other. They're close. change it over to the rocket once that launches. I right, miss, let's go over to him. If we can get one sal more salvo up and then we'll turn away from the torpedo. Might have to do that a bit sooner than later though, because we know we don't turn too fast, but he's flooded. Come on, just launch, 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 launch. Nah, it's not worth it. I'll go for it. Up. He's bugged out as well. Time to do as much chasing as we can. But I think we might end the battle here. I don't think we're going to be able to chase them. What are they at? 22. If they're at full speed. He's severely damaged though. Can't believe we miss. Let's see if we can sink him.
Oh, gotta watch this one. thing is we are in torpedo range oh that should be the end of him come on we even touched this one what have we Another one. There's another torp in the water. Ooh Two close calls. out maneuvering these uh, torpedo boats at the moment. I think I named my last uh, episode Cat and Mouse. Uh, this should have been the Cat and Mouse. Look at this. Oh, again. This is dangerous, this one. Whoa. Three torps. Maneuvered against. Whoa, that is crazy. And we've got another fast mover in the water. This one, I don't know if we're going to have fun getting that one out of the way. We might miss. We're going to be hit. We're hit on that. Okay. That's going to hurt. So out of five torpedoes, we've been hit by one. And he's ready to hit another one. Oh, we're in deep trouble now. If we can sink this as fast as we can, we might get another torp. If we get one more torp right now, we are in deep. Come on, you've got to sink him now or we're in trouble. So you got to talk. He's not no ammo, no ammo. So just focus on this one. He's out of range now. What about you? One top left. No. Whew. No top. One top. You've gone. So we should actually focus on you.
We are in deep trouble. Need to put him out. The express <laughs> needs to have a full stop right now or we're in trouble. Oh, it's just about to get underway. No! Nah, we're, we're all over. Well, we tried to withdraw, we tried to run, but we just had to go in for the battle. And I can't get away from this one. We will be taken out. There's no way. Technically that shouldn't have hit, but we'll take we'll take the loss. And we're all over. Another battleship gone. Ouch. Totally defeated. And we are running low on battleships. Well, I did start say at the start of the campaign that I will be very much surprised if I survive. So that's uh, that. Let's uh, go into the next turn. We've got a lot of battles there. Let's see how our ships are going. We've researched probably a little bit more. What anything? Research, complete a repair, complete a repair, complete a repair, finish production. We do. And we haven't got any more research. Let's move. What else can we do? Gun layout, turrets, shells, explosives, torpedo tubes. Let's, what do we do? Control. Let's move that over here. Take that away, put you back in big guns leave that there for now okay not going to design any more ships but we will put another battleship into production because we lost our battleship and let's see what battles we have and if we can get them done in this episode equal battle Similar battle to our last battle, torpedo bent boats against a light cruiser and a battleship. That'll be a fast battle, probably lose every single one. Feel like a challenge, let's go. Oh, they're in close proximity pretty quick. Wow. All right, first thing I wanna do, I wanna put all you on aggressive. Wow, now let's pause this a minute. Who's controlling who? You're all following that guy. Everybody's following that. Okay, I want to group. Take everybody out. Let's get you off. Detach. And you're off by yourself as well. All right, I'm happy for you. You can just follow. Uh, you can go and follow. And the rest I'm going to try to maneuver myself or maybe... I will get yourself to follow. What have we got? S12 and S21 will follow you. They should be now. Oh, you can only follow one at a time. Okay. Oh no, they're all following. Okay, good. Let's get the battle started. We're going to have to get this torpedo in the water as quickly as we can because they're going to do similar to what we did. But we're going to try to get these. And you're going to go in. We don't want you to go in yet. We want you to come this way first. And I want you to be on aggressive. I'm going to run this, it's slow at the moment. 
Who are you? Okay, and you're going up. So I want you to go around this way. May as well get there on armor because we're not going to get any damage otherwise. I knew that was going to happen quickly. So I'm sacrificing. Come on, get the get the torp out. Get the torp out. Because once he opens up on that next one, we're not going anywhere. Torp in the water. Come on. That's it. Let's get out. Let's bug out. We might be able to bug around here. I'm going to bug you off and tell you to follow you. Corp's going to miss him. I don't want you to launch yet. Put you on normal. Go aggressive. Huh, we put a bit of fire on his decks. we've slowed down a little bit so we are in trouble we probably should bug out but I don't bug out Bug out if you survive. Otherwise, we're going for this guy. Ouch. Surprised that doesn't cause damage. I think the developers, you need to uh, fix that up if there's collisions. Aggressive. Come on, put 
torpedo in the water. He's in the water. Bug out. Hopefully he'll turn towards us for our next guy. And these ones. They're turning around. You can turn around to bug that guy. Alright, good, you can turn around. There we go. Nice torpedo hit. So that should slow him down and he should become an easy target. Go back and reload. We can go that way. You can start in that direction. And you two should be able to come up even you're severely damaged. He should be an easy target now. We're going to see, watch out we don't hit our own torpedoes. We should be taking him out quite quickly, except we've got one. No, 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 no. Yeah, we're going to get hit by that. But we're going to hit you back. Alright, we lost another one. And there we go. Should be finished. He should be finished. Two torpedo hits. Brilliant. Alright. Now I think we bug out. I'm happy with that. Uh, it's going to be hard to sink him, but I wouldn't mind finishing him off after he finished us. Have we got any clean, non-damaged destroyers? Nothing. We're going to need a fast destroyer. You're you're not damaged. You're at full speed and not damaged, well, mate. And who's at full speed? Not full speed. So he's finished. He can bug out. You're at 15, you're at 9, and you're at 24. Alright, so let's go. Let's go. Let's you guys bug out. Good. Let's keep going that way. Speed it up. See if we can catch him. If not, we won this battle. We've all got torps. It's got a torp, it's got a, one torp and two torps in the middle. It's the only thing, can we make it? I'll speed this up if we can get to this battleship. We are catching.
be nice if we could follow him. While that's doing that, our other ships are bugging out. Great, you guys can retreat. Definitely going to run. He's now got 11% chance of hitting us, so I don't know if you're going to survive. Why do you seem to be going faster? So I'm trying to keep straight on the wimp because he's got less chance of hitting us. These guys have actually... If he tried to aim at these two here, he would actually probably get hits every time. You're right up the middle. We are catching slowly, but we're going to have to get pretty close because we'll have to turn off where that's where he'll do the most severe damage. He's got his turrets, which are 12 inches. Be nice to damage that uh, main gun, rear main gun. <laughs> Just saying that he's dam he's uh, minor damage on the minor gun, the rear gun. Cool. That'd be pretty scary if you're uh, on one of these ships right now. Caught him. He's going to open up, and I reckon he will do some severe damage to us in a minute. Just caught up. Here we go, watch. Feel it. He missed. get as close to him as we can and then I'm turning off we haven't slowed down yet all right let's slow it down to two times still not close enough if he hits me enough though and slows down I'll turn off which means you will probably hit him it's getting close Alright, we're going to turn off now. Hopefully he'll get off a torpedo. That might make him turn. I was hoping that would happen. Don't launch yet. Don't launch yet. Launch any time. Come on. Got him. Nice one. Which one is... He's just reloading. He is 21. we are got a new top. We're bugging out. Alright, you're going in. Alright, we need to go hit him again. Too slow. You're out of torps. You're gone.
Oh, come on. Get out the way. At least we damaged the ship. I don't know if we're going to be able to sink because we're quite slow on these two, other than this guy. decoy. S9's my decoy. Nice big hole in the ship down there. Wow, that was huge. In the water, let's go. Put, the, put him in the water. Let's go. Torp in the water, let's go. Why don't you put in the torp in the water? It's about to open up on us. Guns are on the other, other side though. No, he's not going to put the torps in the water. Maybe our torpedo tubes. Ah, torpedo tubes damaged. I didn't even know. Smart myself. All right, what's <laughs> he's finished. So that's it. We're bugging out. if we're going to survive we're about to sink we lost we lost him all right we will now bug out didn't realize that he's torpedo we would have had him my fault for not looking at the damage control and that is it let's end that battle and retreat. Good job, Jupiter. Nearly got ya. Waiting for this to bug me out. 
Let's end the battle. He could come back and get us. We've got no engine power whatsoever. There we go. So we did have a victory there with victory points. Okay, so another battle done. We were smashed in the first battle and we were victorious in the second battle. There's a couple more battles here to fight. We're going to try to... Oh, we can't delay these fights. So we're going to have to have that fight in the next episode. And this one as well. It's not letting us withdraw. So we're going to have to have this one as well, which is a very similar fight. We've got the upper hand a little bit on that one. All right. So let's just have a quick look before where we're at. So we've actually got plenty of cash coming in. And because we've lost those ships, our maintenance is quite a lot down. So we could probably up a little bit into our tech. It's the only way we're going to win the way I'm playing. We need better tech. Our transport capacity isn't too bad. We'll up that a tiny bit as well. Crew training, I definitely want to pump at 40% in there. I know it's a lot, but I'm going to need it. And we lost a couple of torpedo boats. So we're going to put a couple of those in the water. And then on the next episode, what we'll do, we'll design a new torpedo boat. We'll design, we'll have a look if we can or if there's any benefit in designing a new uh heavy cruiser and light cruiser as well depending on what we get on our next turn but there's two battles in the next episode to have all right we'll add a couple of these we lost three two but i'll add three torpedo boats um and we you can see here we've got another tour uh, battleship about to come back onto the scene and we've got a couple of cruisers as well and of course our wombat cruiser sorry battleship Awesome. Well, thank you, everybody. That's been a a semi oh, a semi failure, I guess, because we lost a battleship in the first battle. So let's see if we can do better next time. So I hope everybody can join me for the next episode. Again, thank you so much for all the support. I hope you're enjoying this one. And I'm still trying to find something else to get up and live in terms of games or strategy or warfare games. But I'll see what's coming up and coming out. And I will get back to you all with what that will be. But I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks again. And I'll see you all on the other side.